Investigators collected the same male DNA from both the victims, but more than two decades passed and the canal murders went cold, until science finally caught up with the calendar. In 2014, Colleen Fitzpatrick and her team, Identifinders International, began crunching the data, hoping to provide law enforcement with a name. We entered the numbers from the forensic profile into our software, and that's where I came up with six matches to the name Miller. You check your files, and what do you find? I think there were a total of six Millers that were on what I called my master list, and I went down through the list, got to Brian Patrick Miller. Eventually, Detective Schwarzkopf found his prime suspect on that list and discovered that the alleged canal killer had a second identity, a man who dressed up like a comic book superhero and cruised the valley in a decorated car dripping with fake blood. The public knew this man as the zombie hunter. 